Hey guys, so I'll be showing you how to extract Wii U disk images or .wud files using a program called uWizard on your PC. So I'm assuming you've already got the WUD file, so I'm using Mario Kart 8. They're usually around 23 to 25 gigabytes. My, this one happens to be 23.3. So the first thing you need to do is you need to download uWizard, which I'll have linked in the description, and extract it how you normally would. So it, it'll give you this folder, and then when you go inside of it, you'll see four files. You can just ignore the readme and stuff. All you want to do is run the uwizard.exe file. And I'm just going to uncheck that so it doesn't bother me all the time. And select your language. I'm going to be using English. And then this window will pop up. So we're going to click Open Wii U Game. And then we're going to find the WUD file. So mine happens to be in my downloads. Yours might be in a different location and stuff, but mine's here. So it'll it'll like download the cover and stuff off of uh, another website. So yeah, once once you can like see the color and stuff change when hovering over buttons, that means that it's done downloading and you can get started. So to get right to the point, we're going to need the title key and the Wii U common key. So I have the Wii U common key inside of my Samu folder. This isn't something that you need to like get yourself. This is something that's like you can just find in the description. There's really no way to get this yourself. It's just like a key that the that some guy found inside the Wii U and it'll say verified as correct by SHA1. So that means that you know you got it right because the checksum is correct. So you need to do the same thing with the title key. But this is something you have to get yourself because it's different for every game. This is the same for all games. So I'll be showing you how to do that. You're going to go to this spreadsheet. This this has a lot of games on it. And you're going to click Control F on your keyboard and f type in the game. So I'm Mario Kart 8. And you're going to, there's two results. These are for different regions. So we're going to look for the one that matches our game code. So ours is AMKP01. So that means we're going to want to use this one and not the one above it or below it. So let's go over and we're going to find the one that the first one in the column. And we're going to copy this and paste it in here. So it'll say verified as correct by SHA one again. I'll just be showing. I'll just show you what happens if you paste the wrong one in. It'll say incorrect. So you need to make sure you get the right one. Or it will not even work. It won't allow you to extract the image. So yeah, now we're going to do extract game files down here, or you can save the game information if you want, but that's not a big deal. And I'm just going to extract it to my downloads, and I'll make a new folder called Mario Kart 8. So it'll take a few minutes to extract it. It has like the progress and stuff over at the side. So um, I'll just pause video and get back to you when it's done. Okay so when it's done extracting you might notice that the program will look a little messed up and a window might open up in the background. That'll just open up to where you extracted the game to. But I already closed out of that. So I'm going to go to my downloads and the Mario Kart 8 folder where I extracted it to, and then inside this folder, and then there will be two of them. So the data is the actual good stuff, the system is just stuff that we don't really care about as users, but like developers and stuff might care about that. So inside the data folder, these are the three folders that you would use if you were making this game at loading ready. So you can copy all three of these and paste them inside your loading games folder and then you'd be able to run it. But assuming that you want to get the files and stuff, then you would go inside the content folder. And this has like the, I don't know the proper name for it on the Wii U, but I know on the 3DS it was called the ROM FS. So that's what this would be the equivalent to on the Wii U. So it's got like all of the game data, like here's like courses and stuff, GBA Mario Circuit. It's got SCS files, KCLs, stuff we're familiar with pretty much. But it's just a different format and stuff so many of our current programs won't be able to run them without a modification. So 
yeah, that's pretty much how you extract Wii U disk images or .wud files using a program called uWizard. So thank you for watching, like, subscribe, comment for new videos, and I'll see you next time.